Hey y'all, it's Diane with Shawl Craft One in my little barn door, and I have three new journals to add to the booth for Miss Yolanda Carranza, and I'll have all of her information. She has um, she sells stuff on her YouTube channel, so I'll put that link in the description box below. But let's just go ahead and break into these. I love the way she's got them wrapped. They're wrapped in fabric, beautiful pink and gold polka dotted fabric. So I'm going to go ahead and unwrap them, and we'll get started with our flip throughs. Oh my goodness, y'all. These are the cutest little journals. Um, I did not know what I was getting into when I unwrapped them, but oh my goodness, aren't they so stinking cute? I love them. They're so adorable. Okay, so she sent me a letter with it, and she said they all are almost the same. They have over 200 pages, and they're made of chipboard. Um, their measurements on all three is eight and a half by six. Um, and they have lots of vintage pages and ephemera pieces. And she's calling these spring journals, she says. So I am super excited to take a peek. Um, look at how stinking cute these are. And look on the spine. You have the glitter. And then you've got the sweet little pom-pom flowers. I love that so much. And this is the back. It's tied with a grow grain ribbon. Okay. And, and then, of course, you have her card. Now, this is her information, so I'm going to go ahead and hold that up. And it looks like she's on Instagram now, too. Okay, come on, camera. Focus. There we go. All right, so that's her information. And I will, again, I'll put it in the description box below. So you have, okay, I, uh, Yolanda, you have to tell me where you got this paper, y'all. I'm having a fit over this paper because... It's colored paper, but it's embossed in white. And I'm absolutely in love with this. Please, please, Yolanda, share where you got this paper. I love it so much. Okay, so let me make sure I'm in frame good. And we're just going to do a quick flip through. I'll do a more detailed flip through on this first one. And then the second two, I'll just do a quick flip through so that um, you can kind of get an idea because she said they're mainly the same. I love these vintage pages that she uses. Look, this is like a, a Dick and Jane children's book, which I love. Love this graph paper. I love the bunny rabbits. So cute. Oh, this is so cool. It's an envelope, and she's made it a pocket in the center of the signature. So this folds open, and then you have a little recipe card there, and a sweet little tag tucked into that one. So stinking cute. I love that. This looks like um, wallpaper, like vintage wallpaper. I absolutely love this vintage wallpaper. I love the little calico flowers. I love these children's book pages, too. So stinking cute. I always love Yolanda's work. She has very unique, a very unique style. Um, and I love it. Okay, there's something in the envelope, but I'm not going to pull it out because I'll tear something up. <laughs> love this page with the salt box houses or house. Okay, this is the back of, there was a card in there. So you can, this would make good, um, a good page to do art journaling on because it will, it'll take lots of wet stuff. Make sure I'm still in frame. Okay. All right. I'm going to flip a little faster. So stinking cute. I love this so much. I love this. I like to add these in mine and I love these numbered pages. Those are cool. Have a little, oh, how cute is that? That is so cute. You can put a little card in there. Oh my goodness, that's adorable. Okay, and this has today's prayer in it. Oh, I love that. Beautiful little scripture card. Okay, this is a pocket here. And she has some of that really fun um, grid paper. I don't know if you can see it real well, but it's got neat um, lines on it. Uh-oh. 
Okay, I'll have to come back to that. And then in this side, you have a music page. This is an envelope. So what this, what's happening is this is catching on the fold of the envelope. There we go. We got it. Super sweet. I love the little pig. So cute. A little collage page. And it's an envelope. So there's goodies in there. I'm not going to pull them out. I love how she's done this. Oh, how stinking cute is this? Did you print on this or did you stamp it and color it? Oh, wow. Look at the handmade work on that. So pretty. And I love the vellum pocket. And then on this side, you have a vintage flash card. I love her journals because she has such a wonderful mix of new and vintage papers that she mixes throughout the journal. So you have a tag there and then a tag here. I'm not going to pull it out because I struggle. <laughs> Look at how stinking cute the bunny is. Oh my goodness. These are um, Ideals Magazine pages, which I love. Here's the other side of that gorgeous wallpaper. Okay, this is a pocket here, and it's got a little file folder with some goodies in there. I'm not going to take the paper clip off. Oh, this is wallpaper. How fun is that? Pattern paper. I'm loving these ideals pages. And I don't know where you got this paper, but I love this paper. Where'd you get it, Yolanda, if you don't mind sharing? Sweet little pocket here. And it's got all kinds of little... Look at how stinking cute that is. That is a vintage Monopoly I mean, a mini Monopoly card. How adorable is that? Little playing cards. <laughs> cute little Monopoly money. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. So stinking cute. <laughs> That's great, Yolanda. I love that. Okay, you have a little notebook here with lots of pages. And then you can actually do some hidden journaling underneath if you want. Oh, a sweet little altered playing card. How cute is that? I love um, the little appliques that she puts. That's a neat paper. I enjoy going through Yolanda's journals that she makes because she puts so much different stuff. Look at how stinking adorable this shaker card is with the little chick in there. I love these little flowers that she has on there and all the little seed beads. So much fun. That is adorable, Yolanda. Cool little flash card and then a little I love you card. How pretty is this? Yeah, this journal definitely screams um, bright and cheerful in spring with all the pretty colors and flowers and bunnies. I love it. Of all the little bling there. That takes a lot of work to do that. <laughs> okay, so there's three signatures in the journals. This is vintage wallpaper. Finger licking chicken. That sounds good. I'm hungry, so I love this. This is wrapping paper. And I don't know if you can tell, this has like a lilac tint to this paper. I love this so much. Absolutely love this. I'm going to have to go check and see if I can find some of those because I love that homestead style. Sweet little pocket here. Oh, how cute is that? I love how she did that with a monopoly. She just is so creative. 
It's a Monopoly card and a little puzzle piece, a domino. So stinking cute. Such a great job, Le Yolanda. And then that's that wallpaper. And then in the very back, again, she has this beautiful embossed paper. And then you have a tea bag. So much fun. So this one will call sweet because it's so sweet. Let me grab the next one. Okay, so can anybody guess what we're going to call this one? <laughs> this one will be adorable. I love the window that she does on the front cover and it's under acetate and I'm sorry if there's a glare hopefully there's not but I have my my ring light up there and it's pretty big so it throws a pretty good a pretty good glare okay so she has the cute little pom-pom flowers again on the spine as well oh my gosh I am in love with this paper like obsessed so pretty Okay, we're going to do a quicker flip through on this one since it's very similar to the last. Again, there's her information and you get a guest check in that front pocket. Super sweet little bunnies. Got goodies in the envelope. Again, another um, altered flashcard. Okay, I'm not going to take everything out of the pockets because we've already kind of seen what kind of goodies she has in them. So I'm just going to try and flip quickly so that we can get them all in. I love this. I'm not going to pull that out. Love the teddy bears. Oh, I love this paper. I know I said I was going to do quicker flip through and try not to talk, but it's just not going to happen today. <laughs> I have to talk about Yolanda's journals because I love her style. Little notebook. Can y'all hear my stomach growling? Mm-hmm. I am hungry. And I don't usually get hungry this early. It's kind of, um, I don't know, it's probably around 11.30. So, I usually have my coffee for breakfast. <laughs> and then, I usually don't eat till around noon. So, not sure what's up with that. There's oh, all those fun little mini Monopoly pieces. So this one's three signatures as well. Creative, is this creative moments? Precious moments. <laughs> I got it mixed up with creative memories. Sweet little tag there. I have to see the altered paper, I mean the altered card. Super cute. I love those little tiny tickets that are printed on. It looks like um, burlap. Love that. Okay. This is why I don't take them out of pockets. <laughs> Dick and Jane. hear all the birds I have my windows or not my windows but I have my door open in the sunroom and I can hear all the birds chattering absolutely love that super cute little flip up I love that idea with the envelope flips to do them from the top of the page that's an envelope pocket Oh, we have to see the shaker. Oh my gosh, how stinking cute is he with his 
little striped shirt. Let's see if I can get that bead off of his eyeball. I can't. <laughs> He's so adorable. I love that. <laughs> so sweet. I love putting cards in my journals because you can do art drawing on there. You can paint on them. You can put gesso, mixed media, all kinds of fun stuff. This is cool. It's a window envelope, so you could decorate your envelope and put something in the window. I love this. Very pretty. So stinking cute. And then there's your little tea bag in the back. Okay, so this one is called Adorable. And let me grab the last one. This one is going to be called Charming. Super pretty cover. I love the little um, pom-pom flowers. And you have those on the spine as well. I love this paper she has on the back. And then this one is tied with a pink satin. Make sure I'm in frame. I hope I was in frame on that last one. I'm so sorry if I wasn't. I try to check it, but the book walks when I flip the pages. Love this paper she's used here. Okay, quick flip through on this one. Love this card. Little notebook. I think she's used basically the same types of papers and the same types of pockets and things. This is super cute. Um... I think that some of them she's just placed in different spots in the journal, but they all basically have kind of the same thing. Super cute little book page there. I love the way the Ideals magazine pages feel. They have a sweet little texture to them. Little pocket there. Uh-oh. I was afraid I wasn't going, <laughs> wasn't going to get it in there. Super cute with the pigs. These are great, Alonda. Such fun journals. These would be a really fun journal to get for maybe your mom or your grandma. If, um, if they've never done a journal before, this would be a great one to get them started because it's not, um, like it doesn't have so many things in it that it's kind of overwhelming. Um, and I love Yolanda's books for that. Because her books, you can basically kind of turn it into whatever you want it to be. Sweet little tags in there. Little pocket here. Okay, let's see. So cute. How adorable. I love this little collage. There's the altered playing card. These are really cool. Little tag in there. And my crooked, sorry. I know for some people that the crooked journal it gives them problems with their OCD my daughter would have a fit because she she's kind of that way she has a thing with um, with fives you know if if you turn the TV up it has to be on a multiple of five <laughs> she does have some OCD for sure <laughs> I love these pages like this because they bring back wonderful memories of my childhood in school. I had a good um, school life in elementary school with when, you know, you learn how to do all the simple math like this. Love this.
Okay, and then you have a tag and a tea bag in the back pocket. So stinking cute. I love all of these. So this one is charming. This one is adorable. And this one is sweet. And that's how you'll find them in the shop. And if you have any comments or questions, leave them in the comment box below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for me if you will. And I hope you have a great day. Big hugs.